originally been the dining room in this house. Um, a lot of this room is not going to be used as a dining room anymore. I think if I owned the house, I probably would use it for an overflow room for the kids eating when I had company. But um, the, one of the coolest things in this room, I think, is probably this light fixture, which has the original fixture in it for an adjustable light used to be. So that, you know, if you had a dining table sitting here, you could actually adjust your light to come down. Uh, I don't think they make things that cool anymore. Um, all of the original woodwork is still in place in here, which I really think is neat. One thing the house was lacking is a, an entry closet. So we decided to build out actually here. So as you can see, the front door is just on the opposite side of this wall here. Um, so we decided to put a closet right here so that when somebody comes in, you know, closet, uh, closets close enough that we can put shoes and coats right here, just off of the closet. Okay, so we made it upstairs and the first thing we have when we come up is actually going to be a linen closet. And that's because one of the first doors you hit is actually the second floor full bathroom. This originally would have been the kind of central room to the house. Um, there was no bathroom up here, so that chase, the fan just fell. The chase that we showed you in the lower bedroom downstairs um, chases the plumbing up here for a double vanity, um, as well as a toilet. And then we have a full shower tub combo going in here. We had a surround go in, didn't like it, <laughs> decided to take it out. So still unsure what we're gonna do here. Might be tiling, might be another surround, not sure. Um, so this is what the bathroom is so far. Um, we have two doors for this. We have one that goes out to the hallway and then we actually have another door here that goes into what will be the master bedroom on the second floor.